So today we were at the CID headquarters to present to the CID boss a petition calling on the CID boss to arrest, investigate, and prosecute the Minister for Agri, Brian Champong, for the unsavory comments that he made during the Easter break. You are aware that his some viral video to have said that they, the MPP, will not hand over power to the NDC, come what may. And as lawyers, we are of the view that this comment or his comments on that day border on one, national security, and two, an affront to the Constitution. And as lawyers, we think that the police administration must be interested in this matter because as stakeholders in this democratic dispensation, we will not sit by for just one person to pass comments that will bring an unrest, on, uh, that will bring unrest in this country. So that's why we are here today, and we've submitted the petition to the CID boss. We had a copy for the IGP, and we thought we could have met him. Before you go to the IGP, what did the CID boss tell you? The CID boss indicated to us his appreciation of uh, what we have done, and he was, she was of the view that she would take the necessary steps, having received the petition. But once we were also going to serve the IGP, she will wait till we do that. Did they confirm to you whether they saw that viral video of Brian Achampo? The CID boss did not say much. Um, what he indicated to us was that he's happy we have brought this, the petition and they will work on it. As to whether she has seen or the police has seen it, that didn't come up. But in my submission, I said that we have attached a video in a pen drive and that if she hasn't seen it, this is an opportunity for her to now see it. And so what we are doing is not derogating from that. What we are doing is furthering what the police has already started doing. And so we are confident that having started this, the police administration by themselves, clamming down on such speech, they would deal with this matter as well.